Today is the final performance and matinee of Twelfth Night, which is a Shakespeare play um, being put on at the U here. Not one of their main productions, but we spent like six weeks on it. And uh, yeah, it's been a really good time. I'm not a theater student, but I enjoy theater and I never got the chance to do Shakespeare in high school. So uh, it's been really exciting. As I worked through my post-show blues, I did some planning of the week's Creative Writing Club meeting and worked on reading The Fairy Queen for my British literature class. Then, at last, it was time to sleep. Today I have a quiz in British literature, which doesn't sound too bad, but the structure is that we get given this passage from one of the like 20 texts we've read, and we have to remember which text it's from, who the author of that text was, which character said the thing, and then the thematic relevance and why it's important. So I'm a little stressed. I think the English quiz went quite well, so that's very cool. Um, and now I'm going to get lunch. Uh, it is 3 p.m. and I have an hour before my next class, so. Hi, it's Max from After the Vlog, filming in one of my apartment's uh, lounge spaces. The reason that I had taken the bus to West Bank was that I had a debrief for my theater performance for Twelfth Night. Um, I did not record any of it, which is my bad, but we just sort of went over what worked and what didn't during the production. Uh, then, uh, a couple friends and I uh, went over to my apartment and we designed these boxes for the Creative Writing Club meeting. promise this happened, I am not lying, um, and that was pretty much all for, for Monday. But what is Creative Writing Club, you ask, since I talk about it so much and will continue to do so. 
It's a student group that some friends and I started over the summer. It is open to anyone regardless of major, writing experience, writing expertise. Uh, basically, it provides a space where people can work on writing prompts together, talk about writing, uh, share their works. There's a Google Drive system where you share works and you can give feedback to other people. And yeah, it's really exciting. Uh, brand new this year. A lot of time goes into it, but uh, yeah, it's really fun. And uh, we hold meetings twice a month, one of which uh, took place on Wednesday. Sebastian, what are we doing here today? We're printing name tags for the creator writing blog. <laughs> These donuts are so cold and they ran out of cider. Cheers. It's appreciated. The meeting went pretty well, I think, um, but I don't know, today's been a day. I, it's kind of, I keep forgetting things and leaving things everywhere and just, I don't know, I was debating whether to record this, but I figure that week in the life shouldn't just be the fun things and um, cute little montages. Uh, it has been a bit of a tough day. Um, I think I always have a hard time with like imposter syndrome and stuff like that. And a great thing about the university is you're surrounded by all these cool, accomplished, talented, incredible people. Uh, but then sometimes it can be hard to, to feel like you're living up to that, I think. Um, and there's just the weight of college. You're sort of expected to, you know, prepare yourself for the entire rest of your life and you're spending good money to do so. Um, so I think today, yeah, just a little bit overwhelming, but that's okay. Things will get better. Um, yeah. Maybe it doesn't help my state that I've uh, spent most of today reading Titus Andronicus, uh, which is Shakespeare's most insane play. If you think Shakespeare is boring, I urge you to read this. Um, however, if you're faint of heart and you don't like uh, extreme violence, I don't recommend it. It's kind of gross, kind of eh. So, um, it's a bit of a struggle, honestly. It is a rainy Friday night in October at an isolated cabin in the woods. It's cozy.
After the improv show, I watched the newest episode of The Wise Fellas, a comedic web series I made with some of my best friends over the past summer and highly recommend. You should come back home, back on your own now. And then it was time for The Weekend. After that, some friends and I visited my roommate Sanjali's house to celebrate Diwali with her family. It's always really nice to go to houses again after spending so much time in apartments and dorm rooms and yeah, it was a really fun time. The standoff of a lifetime. Big enough for the moment. No, 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 hold on. You gotta it. Oh, no, 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 And that was the end of my week. A bit pretty busy, a little bit overwhelming, but a lot of fun as well. Hopefully gave some sort of glimpse into, at the very least, my life, but you know, University of Minnesota life as well. Um, thank you so much for experiencing this week with me. And yeah, um, until next time, goodbye.